Hello everyone and welcome to Neat Mentor. So the examination got over and you might be getting an idea how much score you are going to get and based on the score you will need to know how much rank is expected in your score. So everything will be expected in expected score how much is expected rank that you can know based on this tally. So based on our analysis because once we are going to decide the cutoff score or like a how much rank is expected on what score then there are multiple factors it depends on we will talk in uh, deep about all these things if you are new to this channel you must subscribe the channel and hit the like button of the video and for paid counseling guidance you can contact us on 9319128677 this is whatsapp number as well so you can send whatsapp messages also so there are multiple factors one of the factor is how many candidates appeared for examination how many candidates registered doesn't matter how many candidates actually appeared for the examination and uh, out of those uh, candidates uh, the second second point is uh, what is the what was the paper difficulty level so when we talk i have already made a video on paper difficulty level it was more or less like last time but little bit tougher compared to last time the paper was uh, on the moderate moderate side and last time it was easy easy to moderate uh, mixed type of questions were there so we can and uh, this year more candidates have appeared i will create a separate video based on the data from uh, 2019 to 2022 how many candidates appeared and all such analysis will be there in separate video just want to make a uh, video quick and short so i have uh, divided this uh, slot so you can see uh, starting from 300 up to 700 what can be your score in your expected what can be ex your expected rank in your expected score so <clears throat> this year we are expecting more than 1 lakh candidate to qualify region is very clear more candidates have appeared for the examination and uh, the percentage there is a fixed number of percentage which will be ranging by margin of 1 to 2 to 3 percentage and uh, so we are expecting more than one like three thousand candidates to uh, qualify this time and under general category the rank can go up to 94,000 so candidates who will get 300 plus or just qualifying plus a score okay they can expect their rank up to 94,000 those who are getting around 325 score they can expect their rank to be landing around 78,000 if your score is around 350 okay then you can expect your score between 69 to 70000 for a score of 375 you can expect the rank between uh, around 60000 this year the rank will be little higher little more compared to last time in the same score it means uh, since the competition is higher compared to last time uh, so the rank will also shift uh, towards higher side in 400 score you can expect rank of 49,000 these all based on our analysis it can deviate by uh, 4 to 5,000 okay 425 score you can expect rank of 40,000 and in 450 score you can expect up to 33,000 in 475 it can go up to 27,000 if you have a score of 500 then you can expect around 19 to 20,000 rank 525 score uh, 13.5 thousand rank you can expect in 550 around under 10,000 you can get in 550 score if your score is 575 plus then you can expect around 5 to 6 thousand rank in 600 plus 3,000 or under 3,000 if your score 3 to uh, 625 you can expect around 1000 to 1200 rank a score is around 650 then you can score uh, then you can expect the rank under 350 or 300 if your score is 675 okay now then it will be under top 100 and 700 plus then it will be under top 10 candidates so this is based on our, our analysis it will help you in getting rank because when you see last year cutoff okay and any video mostly it will be based on the rank so based on your expected score this video will help you to get out 
expected rank and based on expected rank you can get to know which uh, branch you can get and uh, in which colleges okay um, in which states all such calculation you can do so i hope this video is useful and if it's useful then you don't uh, forget to share with the, within your group share with your friends colleagues and uh, you can also avail our paid counseling guidance guidance where we will support you starting from inct counseling process dnp counseling process mdms state level counseling process open state counseling process all india counseling and nb diploma counseling process okay so thanks for watching and have a great day goodbye and take care